Family Action couldn't do what it does without volunteers. They're crucial in our fundraising efforts, but they're also a really key part of the delivery of our services. Um, there are services across the country that just couldn't happen without their help. Family Action has a history of working with volunteers right back to the days of Octavia Hill when volunteers were key to providing support to vulnerable families. And within Family Action, it's part of our ethos to involve volunteers. So these are people that can enhance the existing workforce, give that little bit extra. And also, in turn, they will have increased opportunities in their own lives to go forward. I attended the session as a sort of dad with my children. I then volunteered to run a couple of sessions and then from them really I've gone on to do my MVQs in early years and now I'm a fully qualified level 3 early years practitioner. I've been volunteering for at least three or four years. I've helped supporting groups, um, I've helped support the parents, it's helped them with their children. As a perinatal volunteer I support uh, families in the community with mild to moderate um, mental health issues um, and like postnatal depression. So basically a listening ear, um, support, put them in the right places where they need to be and, and just be there. Family Action offered a six week training course um, with the other volunteers um, which was really good and gave us a lot of um, ideas. Um, but then they also offer supervision so we can keep in touch with the other volunteers and talk about our experiences and let us know that we're not on our own. There's still, you know, a network there. I work on the reception. I do filing. I do meet and greet people, answering the phones. Um, a bit, a little bit of everything, really, um, which is all new for me because I've not done anything like that before. But it's they really are supportive and you know and helping, so I'm really enjoying it. Well, being a volunteer is really good because you feel as if you're giving something back. You're being useful. You're learning as well. You're meeting people, getting outdoors, and you're just generally enjoying life. It boosts your confidence more as well, especially if you've not been in work for a while. Um, I've focused on my, my family, and my family's been everything for the past five years, and it, it's, it's a great feeling to get yourself back into work, to learn new things as well, so it's, it's, a, good, it's a good thing to do. Volunteers add a huge amount to family action. We have 700 staff, but we also have hundreds of volunteers, and those volunteers add lots of extra capacity to what we can do and mean that we can work with more people and, and reach more people and do more and do better. So volunteers are hugely important. Volunteers work with us in so many different ways, from trustees on our trustee board helping us to govern the charity, to people who are volunteering as fundraisers, running events, running marathons, baking cakes, bringing money into the charity through that route. I'm running the London Marathon for Family Action, which is an amazing opportunity for me. I've always wanted to run the London Marathon and I get to run it for a fantastic organisation because as a primary school teacher working in London, I've seen the direct impact that the organisation has um, for children and families. I decided I wanted to run the London Marathon for Family Action because I wanted to raise as much money as I could for this amazing charity. Um, I just think the work that Family Action does is just brilliant. It doesn't just help the, the whole family, it also supports vulnerable young people and older people. If somebody is considering volunteering at Family Action, I would say come and join our family here. Bring your time, bring your commitment, bring the skills that you have and I can guarantee a really rewarding experience. You'll be making a difference to people's lives and you'll be making a difference to a really significant charity too.